Alright, yo peoples, this is these shits again. Just doing what he do. Alright, today I'm gonna use fortune ladies, just cause they're funny. <laughs> Alright, first off, we're gonna start with green cause it's my favorite color. Fortune lady win. When she's normal summon, you pop back row equal number. Fortune ladies out of the field. So she's a hypno corn, pretty much. Have fun with that. Uh, <clears throat> Run two waters. Just cause when she's special summoned by a fortune lady effect. You get to draw two. And that's pretty buff. D two fires, just because there are a lot of beaters and I don't feel like killing them, so I just sub out to her. <laughs> and swing for what, 400? I forgot what it was. Yep. <laughs> and she does ma and she does burn damage. Burn damage is always nice. <laughs> Let's see now. Three lights. Pretty much just because light is this engine. When she leaves the field, do to anything, you can special summon another one from your deck. So you can be like, remove a light, special a dark, she, uh, this, which is your beater. This one blows up stuff, like I said. Draw two. And this one just doesn't do anything to your normal summoning, so no. <laughs> Pretty much, you, really, you go from one of these, one of these, to one of these. And you say, get at me. All right. Next, we got. Let me see. Next, we got one, two, three darts. Just because these are your beaters, and their effects are when you kill one, special summon a fortune lady from your graveyard, and most likely they'll. They, and they still get their effect popped off again. Most likely you'll grab another fire, just because it usually dies anyway. And then you just pop off another monster. Sometimes you can grab the water if you're lucky. It's the second strongest one out here. Other than that earth thing, which no one uses. <laughs> and, um, yeah. This one makes you, and you, like, kill a monster and you draw two off of it. But it has to go to the graveyard. That's the only catch. So, crystal beasts suck. Alright, next. Three. Watt pheasants. <laughs> yes, because I love their effect. And it's a pheasant. I didn't even know what a pheasant was until I saw this card. But anyway. <laughs> Watt pheasant. What Pheasant's effect is it can swing directly, and every time it does direct damage, it can remove from play one card. Now, most people would probably just be like, remove from play their next card so their a card can attack. Well, I use it to remove away my Fortune Lady. Remove my Fortune Lady to pop to special another one, and it gets my whole train going again and again and again. And what's best is at the end phase, my light comes back again, and I have a beater, and I have another monster in the field. So pretty much I've turned two to three... When one just can't be targeted anyway. Alright. Hmm. Next we got... One, two... Two Cyber Valleys. They protect me for one battle phase, and I can remove them to draw. I'll be, but the only sad part is that... I forgot which, which one missed timing again. I think... The, the light. <coughs> yeah, the light missed timing. The yeah, the light misses timing with this. But it's still to get a remove out of play, which is pretty nice to draw to. Um, <clears throat> double honest, just because you can't run three, so two has to do. Protects your watt pheasants and your lights for when you need to wait. Um, that's pretty much that. Shining angels, two of those, your searchers. They grab your honest, your cyber valleys, and your watt pheasants. Um, two barbaros. Because I'll show you a little trick with him. First off, he's a 1900 beater that can just get normal summon regularly. And you can, and like, as I can show you, I can get three monsters out and then have 3k to blow up the field. And with the effect of the field spell, he removes everything. Oh, and Watt Pheasant's effect also cancels out his little 1900 thing, which is pretty funny as well. <laughs> <laughs> um. Necro face, because he's butt ugly, first off. Second off, <laughs> I run the field spell, which removes him to play a card, so then I instantly mill top five, no matter what. And when he's normal exactly. summon, I can send it all back to the deck. Congratulations, Reggie. Like, what the heck? <laughs> Had to interrupt the video just for that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Chaos Sorcerer, one of them, just because I run so many lights and darks, anyway. Removes from play, yada yada yada. You know what he does. Doesn't matter. 
drag because I would do get hit every once in a while, and I can play with this level to take every control. Once of stuff. Long, every once in a while, yes, that's right. This deck is that good. <laughs> <laughs> every once in a while. Please remember, sarcasm sucks. <laughs> Now, most of your hey, 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 <laughs> hey, 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 they are geniuses. <laughs> All right, next we have three DD destroyers. <laughs> next we have three D destroyers. This card is also another one of the cards that gets popped up. When he, uh, okay, first off, his effect is when he is removed from the field. When he, removed from, when he goes from the field to remove from play, destroy one face up card on the field that your opponent controls. So then I can be like, what, pheasant? Or the field spell, which I've been talking about, but I've never shown you. Which one? This one, Fortune Future, which removes from play a card. And I, was, I instantly pop one off. He's an MST for anything. That's what he said. a little bit more explanation than yeah. you remove a card. Yay, hey, 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 hey. Well, I'll go back to it when I get to it. We have four minutes. We have four minutes. Don't I make can... him grab a trail. Trap. Slip of Fortunes. Another card that indicates an attack and removes another card from play. And I have a lot of stuff that works from remove from play. Do Compulse. To either set off my light or just save my monsters. One Scrap Iron. Just because it's funny. And I don't want to run Mirror Force in this deck. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Dark Hole. Eh, just because. Blows up everything. Monster Reborn. Blows up everything. What? <laughs> <laughs> Oops, my bad. Monster Reborn, grab something from the graveyard to blow up everything. Two creature swaps. <laughs> to set off my Shining Angel Searcher. Or just take their monster anyway. Two Light of Redemptions. I pay 800 to add one Light Monster. That's from my roof and play to my hand. So I can add either, I can add any target, like Fire Move for Chaos Sorcerer, or Watt Pheasant if I want to protect my light, or just grab Honest, or Cyber Valley again. Do Shield Crushes, because I can set it, I can use, I can Shield Crush my own monster to set off the light thing, light play, and I can just Shield cr Crush my opponent's monsters just to be funny. Two Fortunes, three Fortunes Futures. Um, I remove from I send one remove from play light mon uh, fortune lady monster from to the graveyard and I get to draw two. It's my draw engine pretty much. It's good. <laughs> um, now the field spell field spell future visions. This card's effect is whenever a card is normal summon, it is immediately moved from play and then returned during the next standby phase. Now this field spell sets off like three combos. I do. Believe. First combo, Barbaros. You summon Barbaros, it gets removed from play, it comes back as a 3k beater. Next one, Fortune Lady Light. You summon it, it gets removed from play, you can special summon any other Fortune Lady you want. DD Destroyer, and DD Destroyer. He gets removed, he blows something up on the opponent's side of the field that's face up. So it can be like another monster that you don't like, or... A lot of other crap, dude. <laughs> or that oppression. <laughs> that pesky oppression. Oh, I, oh, I hate oppression sometimes. Now, these are your three main targets from to remove from play with this card. Now, as most problem Fortune Lady Dex is... Huh? Necroface and Fortune Shooter. Ah, fine. I forgot. Fourth we, spell. We have a minute. Stop interrupting him. Okay, him. Necroface and Fortune Future. Um... You get, he gets removed from play, you mail top five, and then more, even more cards get removed from play. So you have targets for future visions and light of redemption. Now, the main thing I like about this deck is the fact that it doesn't have, the whole system doesn't rely on just this card. You can use Watt Pheasant just as well. It just takes a bit longer. And, like, the, only, the, uh, the other beautiful thing about this card is that you have Honest to protect either one of these two cards, your two engines. Honest to pump for light, or honest to pump for Wi-Fi, isn't it? 30 I, seconds. Alright, yep. Th those were the main combos of the deck. Everything else is just pretty much regular fortune ladies. Um, this deck's pretty much just straight laughs. You will hate it when you draw bad, but you'll love it when you draw God. And it's funny. Now, have fun with it. Make it if you want. Hate it if you want. I like it. <laughs> <laughs> Peace.